If you're new to the channel, if you can go ahead and subscribe as well as smash that like button, that would be awesome. So this video is all about breathing while running. How do you do that? How breathing while running can make you a more efficient runner, can possibly make you even a faster runner, and also... Hi everyone, I'm Richard Murray, a professional South African triathlete. I have been running since I was about 10 years old. And I thought it'd be great to give some information uh, about breathing and how to breathe while running. It sounds like a very simple thing to do. It doesn't sound very complicated. Um, you pretty much just breathe while you're running, but you know it's a lot, lot more complex than that than you think. Um, and yeah, if you stay tuned towards the end of this video, I'll give you uh, tiny little bits uh, that kind of connect the whole puzzle to breathing and why breathing can be such a great asset in your running. Um, repertoire and yeah definitely something that will be uh, really really help you as a runner uh, in the long run uh, excuse the pun <laughs> but uh, I think uh, it's definitely something a lot of people overlook when it comes to finding that little bit of an edge that you can to become a better runner and breathing you know different techniques and different ways of going about breathing definitely really really can help your performance also to help you become very relaxed or more relaxed while you're running. You're never really relaxed when you're running, uh, let's be realistic. But yeah, it's definitely something that can help you improve as a runner. And obviously uh, having better control of your breathing will definitely help a lot of other things in general, not just running, uh, everyday life as well. A little bit like meditation. Yeah, so the first thing we'll start with breathing while running. Uh, I've had a lot of people ask me the question, how do I breathe while I run? Do I breathe through my nose? Uh, most of the time, do I breathe through my mouth? Do I short breathe? Do I breathe long controlled breaths? Do I breathe from the stomach? Do I breathe from the shoulders? These are all the different questions a lot of people kind of ask and would love to know the answers to. So here are the answers uh, and uh, kind of how I have changed over the last few years to do with my breathing in running. It obviously translates to swimming to a certain degree and it also translates to my cycling as well. So this is not just for runners, this is obviously for cyclists out there as well. Swimmers have got massive lung capacity so I won't be talking all that much about swimming, this is not, it's not my strongest point. But definitely running controlled breathing can definitely definitely help you lower your heart rate, become more relaxed and become a faster runner at the end of the day. So I'll head all the way back to when I was a teenager, started running, used to get a lot of stitches. Uh, write down in the comments if you've ever had stitches while you're running. I'm pretty certain almost everyone has had stitches when they've started to become a runner. And obviously as you're building your fitness, kind of you go through those phases of fitness and you can obviously get through that and you become a better runner with controlled breathing. And the one big thing that I like to do uh, just for running uh, to control your breathing is just try and breathe from your abdominal and try and breathe from your stomach from lower down inhaling from below your ribs and kind of exhaling from below your ribs try not to breathe too much from the shoulders try not to tense up your shoulders when you're running so kind of drop the shoulders relax the shoulders breathing in and out from your diaphragm from your ribs will really really help you to to be more relaxed when you're running to be more calm when you're running and to, to lower your heart rate you can go out there and test it out. Go out and while you're running, try and take a couple of long breaths in and long breaths out while you're running over the period of one or two minutes. Go ahead and check your heart rate, see what your heart rate is doing. You'll notice your heart rate would have dropped by a couple of beats. And this really, really can help you control your heart rate and it makes you more of a relaxed runner, which if you look at the Kenyans or you look at Ethiopians, you look at the top runners out there, obviously some British Mo Farah, uh, these types of guys, they really, really control with their breathing. They're very, very relaxed upper body, very relaxed while they're running. And this definitely shows in their performances and definitely, definitely helps them with the controlled breathing. Stitches, a lot of people say, why do you get stitches when you're running? There's a lot of different things from, from tight muscles along the ribs, 
a shortness of breath if you hyperventilate. So if you're breathing very, very short, short intervals of breath, you're getting less oxygen in every time you breathe in and you breathe out. I'm not a sports doctor, so this information is just coming from um, my experience as an athlete. So if there's any people out there saying this is completely wrong and it's absolute nonsense, uh, go and head on to the comments. I'd love to know your opinion, what you think about breathing and run running, how you breathe while running. Do you do you mentally focus on your breathing or not? Love to know what your guys' opinion is on that. So as I said, breathing controlled from the stomach in and out, not from the shoulders, not from the neck, not from the upper chest, not scrunching your shoulders together. You really don't want to be doing that. This will definitely make you more tense, more stressed. You want to try and relax your body. Breathe in from the stomach. If you can breathe through your nose at certain times, try and do that. Obviously you need to have a very good clear sinus to, to be able to do that. But uh, it definitely will really, really help you to, to bring your heart rate down, to be more relaxed when you're running. And definitely something that I try and do even during a race, uh, in, a, in a race scenario, while I'm racing, I try and obviously control my breathing while I'm running. Um, even if I'm, my heart rate is over 180 towards 190 even, during my 10K PR attempt, I was still trying to control my breathing, even though my heart rate was getting elevated. So. A lot of people tend to, to try and breathe in and out faster, the faster they run. And the trick with this is, is trying not to change your intervals of your breath. So you try and obviously it will increase the faster you go, you need more oxygen in your body. But definitely I think to try and keep the intervals the same in your breathing and just take obviously deeper breaths than taking shallower breaths. And if you take those deeper breaths in and out, you're gonna be getting in more oxygen, you're gonna be converting that oxygen better in your body, and you're gonna be running more efficiently. You might not be running faster, so you know, saying that uh, your breathing is gonna make you faster, a very difficult calculation, I'm not sure if that's true. I'm, I'm sure there is some truth into um, being more relaxed when you're breathing. There might be a 4% or 3% difference in there, not 100% certain, but I definitely think it will help you, especially on a marathon, the longer the distance get, the more you control your breathing, uh, the better you'll be over a longer distance, over a longer period of running. If you enjoyed this video, uh, if you can go ahead and give it the, the thumbs up and subscribe to this channel, that would be amazing. I've got a whole bunch of cool videos coming out. I've added many, many requests on different types of running and things, obviously swimming as well. So there's a lot of different things that I wanna get out there. Uh, videos. Uh, so yeah, I hope you enjoy this video. Uh, drop a comment down, subscribe if you can. Hope to see you shortly for the next video. Cheers everyone.